let's lay down the lay down the discussion china u.s trade war you want to call it right look at the picture this way china is a corporation okay it's a central corporation that is functioning or has been functioning on all cylinders making sure all of its different branches of governance control are synced up so they can push their one agenda which is one belt one road initiative which basically means that china is trying to make sure as much of the global economy goes through it as possible okay may it be through africa may it be through asia may it be through europe may it be through the pacific may it be through north america so consider china one gigantic corporation now the united states it is a corporation it is run by corporations but there isn't synergy among all its branches there's beginning to be synergy among all its branches right there has been synergy between its military and its corporation corporate agenda right banana republic we talked about this stuff the origin of banana republic how the u.s military is used to secure resources for american corporations around the globe and all that jazz right but the synergy is not complete like china so the corporations in the united states right now and we know it's not in just going back to the United States, we know, we know that the synergy is not complete because U.S. corporations have been chasing growth, have, have been chasing growth and profits by farming out their uh, factories to China, right? They've been making products in China to sell to the United States, right? And the rest of the world, right? So they were chasing cheap labor no environmental regulations minimal tariffs as possible right but now they're realizing that there are chinese corporations coming up that are starting to leave them in the dirt right technology is one place we're seeing this china is number one with 5g silicon valley is way behind right hence the trade war arrest of Huawei executive in Vancouver uh, banning 5G technology from Huawei in different parts of the Western world. China recently saying that they're going to make their code, they're going to make it open source. They're going to make their code available. They're not putting the code of the 5G technology behind uh, closed doors, right? To allow whichever company, whichever country, that buys their 5G technology to modify that technology to suit their own means. And that way they can take a look at the background code to make sure that there's no back doors. Now this is gonna take a tremendous amount of manpower to do this, right? Any back doors spying on them, right? That's China fighting back. US tech companies are trying to ban their technology from being used in the Western world, right? So what's going on between China and the United States is corporate wars. Okay. That's what the United States is trying to prevent. They're trying to slow down the rise of China, hopefully turn it back down where they start declining. I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think the U.S. is going to be successful unless it's a full-blown military operation and they can't hit China right off the bat. They have to hit China's tentacles, right? China's extremities. May it be in Africa, South America, Middle East, Asia, right? They can create turmoil all around to slow down China's growth and China's leverage to the tilt, right? So we'll see how all that plays out. They, these are corporate wars where in the midst of right now.